Hello, this is Magenta Pixie. I was asked if I could bring forward the collective and ask them about crop circles. How are they made and for what purpose are they made? And this was their response on this. Dear Pixie, Crop circles are created by the circle makers. The circle makers are able to manifest electromagnetized waves of energy, similar to lightning, but a far hyperdimensional form of lightning than the one you experience during a storm. These manifested energy waves are living entities. They are extraterrestrial time traveling waves, or pulsars might better explain them. Man's questionings and seekings have always been to remember who they are and why they are here. The circles come to remind us of these very things. They awaken and decode our DNA. Each crop circle is made by a different vibratory pattern, each as different as snowflakes or fingerprints. Each have their own energy signature. So who are these circle makers? Those who are ultimately the creative force behind these waves of lightning type energies. Why you, of course? Humanity on Earth. You are the circle makers. You create the crop circles with your very consciousness, your thoughts, your questions. The combined thoughts of humanity on Earth, when focused together, create a vortex of frequency in response. And the polarity symbols to those thoughts, the answers to the questionings of man, as it were, manifest the circle maker energies to create the crop circle symbols. The symbols are there as reminders for you, triggers, to wake you up so you may remember who you truly are, why you are here, what you can expect to happen while you are here, and what exactly are you to do about it. The answers to your most profound questions are all there in the crop circles. Take note of the messages, even if you do not understand them with the logical mind. Looking at pictures of crop circles, trying to draw the symbols yourself, or better still, visit and stand within the circles. The energetic blueprint of the circle will raise your vibration and activate your DNA. Some very sensitive individuals may find some crop circle energies too strong for them. This is because they are already vibrating at the highest frequency point for their current evolution and their physical form can hold no higher frequency at that precise point. But for those who currently can raise higher, crop circle energies will activate this raising of frequency and precipitate healing where needed. So the collective consciousness of humanity literally creates the circle maker energies. Are these circle maker energies then independent of humanity or are a representation of their consciousness in another form? The answer to this is both. The living electrical lightning forces that actually create the circles are pure consciousness acting as it is directed to do. This is the pure science of it, as it were. The metaphor to this natural force gives us the intelligence behind it, so we may see clearly with the third density human brain what the crop circles are. They are communications from the higher self-consciousness of humanity to the lower self-consciousness of humanity. The higher self-consciousness of humanity encompasses a wide field. Therefore, is it extraterrestrial entities creating the circles or the Earth itself? Is the energy beamed from above or coming up from the ground? Again, it is both. The cosmic and earth energies combine together to manifest a higher self-communication to humanity's lower self-consciousness. For humanity's higher self-consciousness is extraterrestrial and is the planet Earth. So does this then mean that crop circles are messages from an advanced extraterrestrial race delivered here to help us in some way? 
Yes, indeed, that is exactly what they are. You are that advanced extraterrestrial race, dear humans, and it is that advanced extraterrestrial race, your higher self, that shall be manifest within you in its entirety when you return to the core at the winter solstice 2012. And when that happens, you shall indeed see that making crop circles is child's play. We are the white-winged consciousness of nine. <laughs>